So an update on the 320 gallon aquaponic system in the basement. Uh, we added 25 tilapia. Um, you can't really see them, the system was just running so the water's a little bit uh, murky and stirred up. But we put 25 tilapia inside of the fish tank, which really increased the nutrient levels for the grow beds. So everything seems, be, everything seems to be doing really well. Also on the fish tank, we attached an air pump just to increase the levels of oxygen inside the water for the fish. Uh, we also added uh, this large heater here. Um, we keep the tank just above uh, 75 degrees, around 75 to 80 degrees. Um, it helps the fish to just stay active with their metabolisms and continue to eat. We had to slow the outtake of the water down a little bit, so we used a clamp there to just allow the water to increase faster and rise faster in order to just slow out the bottom drain. So as far as the plants go, we have um, our four tomato plants in the back. They seem to be doing really well. There's been some spots on some of the leaves, but we've just clipped those leaves back and everything seems to be doing really well and they're going pretty strong. Uh, some of the, the two on the far left are actually flowering right now, so hopefully we'll get some fruit off of those. Um, we still have the radishes from the first video. Uh, they don't seem to be doing too well. Uh, they're not putting too much nutrients into the root. We're hoping that those will pick up eventually here. Um, in this bed, we also have two cucumber plants in the back corner uh, behind, the, behind the outlet. We also have uh, more, six more cucumber plants along the back, which we're going to have trellised um, so that they go up against that back wall there. So those seem to be doing really well. Those shot right up. Our pepper plants are doing very well. Um, we have some flower buds here, so hopefully we'll get some flowers on there and get some peppers off of those. The strawberries, we put a, about a dozen strawberry plants in. Those all put out flower about four days ago. Um, so I pollinated those. We just strict pollinated those. Hopefully those will come through and we'll get some berries off of those. The three pineapples, we got two pineapples over there and then one back here behind the broccoli. This pineapple is, all three of them are rooted, but this one's showing new growth. Um, so we're hoping that that will start to grow and take off soon. Our broccoli is doing very well. Uh, we got a couple of large stalks in here, so those are doing fine. Those are staying very green um, and seem to be flourishing in this aquaponic system. So I'll have to put more of those in next time we go around and put new plants in. The sage is doing really well. The parsley, uh, a little bit sparse, but we got some good shoots over there. Hopefully that will start to fill out a little bit more. And then our most recent project was this mango tree. Um, I'll be posting a blog on where that came from and how to prep and plant mango seeds. So uh, keep an eye out for that. We also have uh, these two avocado seeds that are in here. This one has rooted, so we're hoping to get a shoot off of there soon. Uh, I think you can actually see it down there. So hopefully that shoot will come up soon. And um, I'm not sure about the other avocado. So that's the aquaponic system, the 320 gallon system in the basement. Everything to be, seems to be doing really well. One other thing that we have noticed is we are getting some flooding in here on that. The, the gravel is starting to settle. We have some low spots so we're going to have to get some more gravel and fill in some of those areas. But besides that, everything is working very well and we're hoping to get some good fruit off of these. So.